everybody and welcome to GeoGuessr with the Strange Lands crew. We have Alzareth here. Hello. Talk. Rejoice. And we are, and I'm Fixer, and we are playing <laughs> another custom GeoGuessr challenge. This one has been submitted by Mr. Filmmaker 08. I believe it was done in January, and we're getting around to it now. I don't think this one's a, a um, what's it called? Theme. I'm double checking real quick. No theme. No theme. All right, cool. So, seed will be in the description below if you'd like to play, play along. Uh, this is in the retro style GeoGuessr, so remember there is no built in timer. If you guys are going to do this and compare your scores with us, put a two minute timer per round because that is what we are going to do. So, are you guys ready? Yeah. I am ready. Affirmative. Three, two, two one, go. Sounds like the uh, the old internet might be crapping out a bit again, which is uh, irksome as always, but what can you do? Uh, let me use this France, then Route 66. Okay, okay, so it isn't Haiti. It's. I'm going to guess this is just... I have no idea. It could be a... Uh, I mean, this isn't America, surely. Um, is this Haiti? No, this isn't Haiti, no. It's not, not Haiti talk, it's not Haiti. There are, there are some places that are ha ha Haiti, and then there are some that are decidedly not Haiti. Okay. Um, this could be a French colony. Um, it's my, the, the talk potato dies. Uh, the, I guess probably the problem is we haven't had many in France, so I'm not very familiar with all the names of the places. Guermont? Was there a Guermont in here? I feel like I should probably just keep that looking for clues. Okay. What was to say? Go down. Ah, uh, come on. You can do it. Is, how's the talk potato? Yeah, the talk, the talk potato is a bit too hot to touch, yeah. It's, it's awkward. Uh, oh. Uh, oh. Uh, oh. Come on, talk potato. You can. Don't overheat and collapse due to geo guesser. This is. This is. This is ridiculous. I mean, I think that in, in a certain way it's, it's good that I have these problems. Because, like, you know, someday. I will have a recording, hopefully. Time's up, make a guess. Oh, yeah. Just, okay. What? Oh. The city. Complain au point? I could, Whatever. I was looking around for, like, Mont and um, all the places on the street side. But nope, no, no dice. So, I, I figured it was obviously French. And where I found a, a restaurant that had like Saint Martin on it, and I thought that sounds like a city name to me. So I looked everywhere for Saint Martin, and I couldn't find it. I guess the west of France, twenty three thirty nine. But now that I zoom in here and I see the Comblain au Pont, and that is, I definitely saw a sign for that. I did yeah. not recognize it as a city name though. So, anyways, yeah. twenty three thirty nine. How'd you dwell? I was a bit torn between France and Belgium. It definitely looked more like Belgium to me. Um, I don't know why. It just kind of like looked older looking, whereas France has been trying to make itself look more modern um so i guess in northern france kind of near the border of belgium just so i'd be able to kind of hedge my bets got 3094 3094 Congress. so the talk potato is sort of like dying so i didn't really get to have a good look around but i just it, i saw french so i guess in france it got 2402 yeah prop the potato up but, so it can breathe okay the potato so... must breathe Tulkis. We've been over this. Some, some, some nail clippers. We'll put it in there. Okay. It's a talk of it who can breathe. There. Be happy. <laughs> All right. So does the next round look awfully snowy to you guys? Yes, yeah. yes. This may be a situation of guess wherever we may. Yeah. We All see. right. Well, let's um, let's go let's to see. it. Is so. It we're guess? Yep. It's, it's definitely snowy. So I'll give you guys five seconds to place a guess oh, five, on the world. Five seconds. Okay, I'll guess in Monaco since we've had the series there. Okay. The the museum. I am going to guess. 
The Musee Oceanographe de Monaco. We were just there. Hey, I'm going to guess where we uh, just were. Remember that? Was, remember that? That was a fun time. And the Avenue right, St. Martin's. Everything, everything. Okay. Make your yeah. guess. All right, so I guessed in northern Australia. I am 8,000 kilometers away and still got 759 points. How'd you do, Al? I guessed in Quebec because we had a French challenge recently, so I figured eh, I'll stick with French. And I ended up getting um, 434 points at 10,399 kilometers away. So didn't we just have a guess in this actual area recently? Um, yeah, it was near Islamabad, but yeah, last week we had one in Kashmir. Uh, I wasn't here for what, that. What are the chances of that? Because these were made at completely different times, and nobody knew the... That, that's just weird. Anyways, what did you do, Talkus? Oh, uh, Talkus Valiant uh, guest in Monaco, you know, the Le Musée Oceanographique, and received 1, 3, 10 points. Okay. All right, next round. Are you guys ready? Yeah. Yes. 3, 2, 1, go. Okay, okay, here we go. And we're here in place. Okay, so don't... So, so the, the, the sore potato, I thought they don't really need to, like, touch the sore potato at all. Like, I just use the mouse to go around and go click and stuff. So I guess having the sore potato elevated isn't really a big deal. Okay, so we'll do that. Okay, now let's look. These look, this, this feels like it could be an Islamic kind of place, but it doesn't look Islamic, so... Mm, probably not. Um... Somewhere in Europe would be my guess. Let's see, this could be Mexico. We'll just examine the race of the peoples. I mean, it was Joe Shahabuddin. Is that a real name or? Okay, Joe, but my man, Joe Shahabuddin is, uh, is taking us on a wild ride. Uh, Just think, this Joe Shadowwood and probably wasn't even aware of the existence of Jugas. Is that like a, is that like a, a coat of, no, not, not a coat of arms. Um, is this America? Is this the Alamo? I mean, I don't know. This could be, no. I'll guess in like Madrid or Valencia or Barcelona. We'll get there. Feels like it could be like an Islamic nah here. It feels like it could be an Islamic kind of architecture thing, like the especially the fountain here in the middle. Feels kind of like, you know I don't know, this feels sort of like a mosque, you know, with the minarets and stuff, I don't know. But then these people this isn't doesn't look to be currently Islamic, so it's like a place that used to be Islamic, but isn't now, and the only place... Time's up, make a guess. Is that in Spain that I can think of? And here we are. Okay, that's nice. Oh, but, um, I figured... I don't know, in a way. Um, at least that's what I got out of it with that one store there, Christy. I went with Italy and got 1960 one based on not Al. pretty much the same situation um at first first they looked kind of uh, viking shields almost but then i remember viking shields generally had, had the circular metal not the h shapes and stuff like that but it still looked like a european to me i'm surprised it was as far south as turkey but the construction i can see how that is definitely a possibility so yeah um my stream viewers are saying would have gone for Persian or something. The only reason I didn't go for Persian is Persians generally use square shields or rectangular shields. So, yeah, I got nineteen twenty-five. Talkus, um, I it looked like a place that had been Islamic, but was Islamic no more. With you know people. Yeah, Talkus is dying. Yeah, well, with people in like Western garb and stuff. I figured that the only place to fit that description was Spain, so I guessed Madrid and got 1751 points. Alright, so if you guys didn't catch that, he guessed in Madrid, Spain. Are you guys ready for 3, 2, 1, go! Oh, okay, we're, we're going, apparently. Oh. I, wanna, I wanna look at the stream. Okay, um, I, I call this. Uh, this is. Bad, bad, okay. Um, 
So Chuborg Bolju and then there's a, a, a tower. Uh hello tower. Um there we're in a place again. Um the Roberto Sanchez Arabello. I guess is this Hispanic? Or what? I mean this looks old. Very old in fact. Move. No, we're we're stuck here, are we? Uh, okay, um so first of all what continent is this? Is this is this Mexico or South America or Spain? This feel like Mexico. I think that's the one I'm gonna say this is Mexico. Then we're gonna, in Mexico, we will guess in like Mexico City, I guess, because I don't know. There you go. Okay, that one's, that's beautiful. Um. Uh, Podgorica. <laughs> but, but like, as I was saying earlier, basically it means that, you know, in the future I will have a good computer and good sound quality, and hopefully no planes, and, you know, everything will be better, so... You know, if I'm just, like, chugging along nicely now, even with all these issues, you know, someday I will have good technology. And that day, I will prosper. Seriously, we're having... Total Time's up, make a guess. Yeah. Grumpy face. Oh, wow. Well, I guess that wasn't, um... <sighs> The sun was to the south, but I didn't trust it. And, and I couldn't really think on any of the signs. The, photogra the photographer's name was... Oh, was I forgot to uh, look at his name. Yeah, well, apparently it didn't help a whole lot if it's in Montenegro. Um, I don't know. It was it was obviously an area, um, but uh, not either. I went with Brazil, got 715. How'd you do, Al? Yeah, it felt European to me, so I kind of stuck over in the year. I was originally looking at some of the small islands, but it was a bit too... Uh, one of my viewers suggested Croatia and language, so I just dropped it in Croatia, which eh, got me 2548. Um, I was about the same distance away if I would have guessed down on the islands I was getting. So, there wasn't yeah, really a whole it. lot of language to recognize the, that app. Yeah. Yeah. A proper noun. There so was, it, it was really cool. one that had like hundred and then a word after it that I could read very very clearly. Um, other than that, it was pretty blurry as well. So what, that three hundred Negro. Um, I do not know actually. Do you, Matt here? He's our <laughs> Googler. <laughs> Matt, 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 Matt came. <laughs> was your score out? Oh, I caucus. Um, uh, I, I just thought it looked like Mexican. Um, the, the <laughs> name of the person was Sanchez. Um, it's, you, you're having the topic to dying, and you're having the internet <laughs> dying. It's not my fault. I was, I guessed in Mexico City and got three nine six points. Oh, so he guessed in Mexico City in case you guys didn't catch that, and then you got three nine six or Do something they? close to. Do they speak Montenegro, or do you know? I, I'm saying that too. They speak Montenegrin language. Hmm. That's what they say. Hey. All right. Uh, well, that's also, I say the reading correct. the stream is cheating. <laughs> All right. Next. Sorry, you got two, one, go. Go. Yeah. This is just sad. It's weird because the uh, the first uh, troubleshoot troubleshooting the talk is valiant because of the first um, you got the viewer challenge you know there were no problems everything's just chugging along just fine there's no internet issues or talk potato issues maybe it's that the talk potato got so hot that it in turn started causing internet issues or something I don't know. Um, but this is really bad. 
So I don't know. Just, uh, painfully pain. Uh, uh. This is someday someone's gonna like calculate who won what GeoGuessr. I'm gonna lose this GeoGuessr and it's not gonna be my fault because so to 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 uh, I don't know where I am. I guess oh this is probably like in the Alps or something actually. Yeah, so there's European cars. Okay. Amazingly enough, if you stop complaining and actually focus on the... Okay, so we're just... And also the... The tall potato! The tall potato lives! The elevation is working. Let me just try this trick more often. Okay, so we're somewhere in... Um, we're, we're, we're in, we're in uh, the Alps, probably. So we're just going to go here, in the Alps. We're, we're, yeah, here here in the Alps. Because we can do know this is going to be Canada. So we're... Yeah, somewhere in the mountains. Switzerland, probably, or something. Yeah, we're down here in the biggest city, so we're saying that we're going to be in Zermatt. Yeah, we're in we're in Zermatt in the Alps. It's all it's all good in the hood. There's a car driving past as always. Um, and Andorra, Andorra, my people, my people, my people need me. Aqua Buffalo, La Dora, La Vella, Franca, ah. My people. Uh, so we're here. Um, Andorra La Vela. Maybe Santa Coma? We could be in Santa Coma looking to Andorra or something. Where's Franca? Oh, I guess Franca in France, France, obviously. Yeah, okay. Okay, so, and, and then after seeing some of the language, it felt like it was Italian. And going further in, I felt like, well, no, that looks like Spanish. But I left it in Italy. What is this little area called? Andorra? La uh, it's a micro state between Spain and France that I didn't know ex That's an interesting uh, exclave. I stuck did. with Northern Italy and got 23... 21, how'd you do well? I was like probably uh, looking at France and Spain, and they educated me on Andorra and Beef Eater. <laughs> nice. Of all things, I ended up with 6380, but yeah. I, I, I didn't know I, much about that state before. How'd you do, Talkus? Um, I, I know a lot about Andorra. I've been, uh, looked up his w Wikipedia page. I always find these microstates really fascinating for some reason. They are in interesting. It's interesting how they form. Yeah, that's, that's really cool. But it's like a, and Andorra is sort of like under the protection of like the French prince or something. It's all it's all brilliant. Like the Spanish, I don't know. But it's uh, yeah, Andorra is. I just saw Andorra, so I guessed an Andorra La Vella and got six zero yeah. nine points. Oh wow! Honestly, that's yeah. all I could get out of that. I can't understand you either. Six zero something. Um, I get in the background. Three, two, one, go. Okay, so we're we're, we're off. Never mind. Whoa. Well, that was an awful school. Two thousand and ninety-five. How'd you do, Al? Al. Go over that. I got fourteen three eight five. I have to get dream viewers for help with the last two, though. Um, I, I, I'm going to actually put that the chat overlay on stream. Okay. Torquez received um, one one Talk. nine three eight points. There you go. All right, so um.
as far as these, right? I think so. Right, that's what I'm thinking too. Because what are the chances of an actual Google um, altogether? Usually, usually a privacy thing, it's not re removed altogether. So I get the feeling that that's like a rem removal of a photo. Sometimes it could probably be like changes in laws as well if it's a Google one. But I, I think it is mostly just going to. Be Thanks to Mr. Here. Film, Mr. Filmmaker, submitting that. If you guys want to submit one of your own, go to geocenter.com. Might be a good idea for us to start um, saying that we should probably avoid thing from happening. The theme to that that we just didn't pick up on as well, because a lot of us looked kind of similar and kind of historic. <sighs> yeah. Yeah, but I think in Europe looks historic. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, it looks like our Google. <laughs> All right, so thanks for watching, guys. See you guys we'll catch next you time. next time. Bye.